All right, I just got through watching the 2022 version of the movie Firestarter. First, let me say I've not read the book. I've not seen the original movie. So what I'm about to say is not based on any of that. But I do not recommend this movie. It was not good at all. I know it comes from Blumhouse and, you know, they're they're really into making uh, horror movies and especially those that can be aimed at a teen audience because a lot of their stuff is PG-13. This is rated R. It is bad. The acting is not good. The special effects is horrible. The first half of the movie seems like they decided they didn't want to spend any money on electricity. It seemed like it was very dark, and I'm not talking about dark as in as in bad. I'm talking about literally you had very little lighting. It was hard to see a lot of it. Um, fortunately, I watched it on Peacock, so I didn't pay for a movie ticket. Um, even if you have Pe- Peacock, I don't recommend you watching this. I would give it one out of five. It is not good. Skip it.